Getting ready for the big day. Your hospital bag checklist. Packing a hospital bag might seem like a small task amidst the excitement of preparing for your baby's arrival. But trust me, having everything you need in one place can make a world of difference when it's time to head to the hospital. Think of it as your labor and delivery survival kit. No need to panic or scramble for essentials at the last minute. With a little planning, you can pack your bag with confidence, knowing you're prepared for whatever labor and delivery may bring. Essential items for mom, comfort and care. During labor, let's start with the most important person in the room, you. Labor is hard work and you deserve to be as comfortable as possible. First things first, pack a comfy nightgown or pajamas. Choose something loose fitting and breathable that you can move around in easily. Don't forget a robe and slippers for those chilly hospital hallways. A nursing bra and breast pads are essential for breastfeeding moms. And a few pairs of comfy underwear will also come in handy. Packing for labor is about more than just clothes. Bring along your favorite lip balm and lotion to combat dry hospital air. Don't forget your toiletries, including shampoo, conditioner, toothbrush, and toothpaste. And while the hospital will provide basic necessities, you might prefer the comfort of your own pillow and blanket. Packing for baby. Welcoming your newborn with open arms. Now, let's talk about packing for your little bundle of joy. Newborns don't need much, but there are a few essentials you won't want to forget. Pack at least two or three outfits for your baby, including onesies, sleepers, and a going home outfit. Choose soft, breathable fabrics that are gentle on your baby's delicate skin. Don't forget socks or booties to keep those tiny feet warm. In addition to clothing, pack a few receiving blankets to swaddle your baby and keep them cozy. A soft baby blanket is also a good idea especially if you plan on spending time in the hospital's nursery or lounging area. Pack a few diapers and wipes, although the hospital will likely provide these as well. And don't forget a car seat. You won't be able to leave the hospital without one properly installed. Section 4. Special Considerations for Caesarean Births If you're planning a caesarean birth, there are a few additional items you might want to pack. Loose-fitting, comfortable clothing is especially important after a C-section, as you'll want to avoid anything that rubs against your incision. Consider packing a belly band or high-waisted underwear to provide extra support and comfort as you heal. Recovery from a C-section can take a little longer, so you might want to pack a few extra comfort items. A good book, magazines, or your favorite electronic device can help pass the time. Consider packing a small pillow to support your incision when you cough or laugh, and don't hesitate to ask your partner or a loved one to bring you anything you need during your hospital stay. Section 5. Personal Touches. Creating a home away from home. While the hospital is designed to provide everything you need medically, there are a few personal touches that can make your stay more comfortable and enjoyable. Consider packing a few of your favorite snacks to satisfy those late night cravings. Bring along a water bottle to stay hydrated, and don't forget your phone charger. To create a more relaxing atmosphere, pack a few photos of loved ones or a small plant. A diffuser with calming essential oils can also help create a sense of peace and tranquility. And don't underestimate the power of music. Pack a portable speaker and create a playlist of your favorite tunes to help you relax and bond with your baby. Section 6. Ready, Set, Deliver. Congratulations. You've successfully packed your hospital bag and are one step closer to meeting your little one. Remember to double-check your bag a few weeks before your due date to make sure you haven't forgotten anything. And most importantly, relax and enjoy these last few moments of your pregnancy. Labor and delivery can be unpredictable but with a little preparation, you'll be ready for whatever comes your way.